What's up guys, it's Mikey to Memo here, and welcome to my YouTube channel, and most of all, welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough, the playthrough of uh, the Hashishin, aka Beliar, and welcome to, I don't know which episode anymore, but part uh, 2 or 3, I'm not sure. No, not very helpful, just make sure to check the title, that one will work, um, it's a bit confusing since I upload, slash, well, I record a lot, slash, upload a lot, so it's real confusing but uh we're gonna continue where we left off in Silden when it comes to questing so without further ado let's go is that your arena you want to fight mora hmm. Who's in charge here in town? Umbrak is our leader, but I don't know if he has time for you. He is always very busy. Maybe you should talk to the town shaman first. His name is Grumple. He's the right hand of Warlord Umbrak. I see. You're a good arena fighter, right? The best. I could use a strong arm to help me clean up the area. <laughs> Why should I help you? I'll pay you well. <laughs> I've got a better idea. Show me that you can fight, and I'll go monster hunting with you. Go see Barak, and I'll enter the arena with you. We orcs will kill all of you! I see. Who's in charge here? Umbrak. He is the lord here. Where can I find your lord? Umbrak is in the big house. What should I know about your lord? Go see Grumple the shaman. He can tell you. You're not exactly the brightest light, are you? You need torches, Mora? Never mind. Where are you headed? We should teach. Always be firm, that's what I say. Um, will, will this be the upper you? quarter? Why else do you think I'm standing guard here, moron? How can I improve my reputation in town? That's simple. Just make yourself useful. There's enough work to do. There's one thing we need in particular. Reinforcements. Reinforcements? Look around you. There's almost nothing but humans here. And barely an orc who isn't feeling completely overwhelmed. What if I help you? You? You are a Mora, just like most people here. If you want to help defend the city, you should train your fighting skills first. I can show you how to improve your fighting skills. But you Moras are just too weak by yourselves. We need more orcs. What we could really use up here is a blacksmith. Go find us a smith! Where are orcs needed the most? We need some guards here within the city. If we don't watch out, the rebels might overrun us in the end. Where can I find a blacksmith for this town? Just walk around and ask the orcs. There must be one amongst them who knows a thing or two about forging. Doesn't get much worse. What are you waiting for? Yeah. Reason? Well, you should probably do it yourself. Hi. Ah, uh, I know you. 
I have met you before. Mm, not that I know of. In my dreams, you were alone and fighting. In my dreams, you were alone and fighting. What else do you know about me? Your future is unclear. Many decisions lie before you. You are different from the other Moras. You are important. Could you elaborate a bit? Hush! Your story has not yet been written. Therefore, I cannot see it. Who's the boss here? Umbrak, the great warlord. The legends of his deeds are known far and wide. And where can I find this great warlord? His throne stands in the highest building of this town, stranger. What's your job here? I serve our leader with my wisdom and clairvoyance. I see. So you're his advisor. Let's see what happens. Teach me your knowledge. Hmm. Amora interested in the wisdom of the shamans. I must admit that I find that somewhat intriguing. Fine. I will teach you if Umbrak, our great commander, agrees to meet you. If Umbak respects you, so will I. I see. I am looking for Zardis. You have a long journey ahead of you then. His tower is in Nordmar, far off to the east. Show me your goods. Here it says something about alchemy. Another layabout in my kitchen. You're the cook here? Stop yanking my chain and get out. I'm busy. Anything else? Oh, shut up. I need raw meat. Fifty joints. What? You can't imagine how much these apes can fit in their stomachs, kid. Go and get me some raw meat. Why can't you be more relaxed? If I don't work hard, they'll chop off my head. So help me, or get lost. Just don't stand in my way. Don't even think about stealing from me, understand? Says who? Sorry, I'm just a little edgy. What's a guy like you doing in a place like this? What's your job in this backwater place? It's not like there's much to do here. I'm just hanging out with the other mercenaries, waiting for something to happen. You're a mercenary for the orcs, and you have nothing to do? Well, sure I do. We capture runaway slaves. It's hard work trying to find someone hiding in those dense forests out there. Does slave hunting pay well here? Much too well. We mercenaries almost fight each other for the privilege. We even let some of the slaves loose on purpose so that we can collect their bounty later. You mercenaries are helping slaves escape? You never heard me say this, understand? If the orcs get wind of this, we're dog meat. What do you know about this town? Sildan lies near the pass to Nordmar. When the war started, the orcs came over the mountains from the northeast. That's why Sildan was the first town to be overrun and captured. Since that day, there have been no more major battles here. Who rules this city? Umbrak. During the war, he was a great commander of the orcs. Grumple, the city shaman, is his right hand. Umbrak will do nothing without consulting him first. You're not a mercenary. You are a rebel. Curses. Me and my big mouth. What are you gonna do now? I don't know yet. Join us. We could really use a man like you. 
I want to help you. Finally, someone who has the courage to get things rolling. When are you rebels going to strike? Here in Sildan, the orcs are in the minority. And yet Umbrak still rules with an iron fist. He must have something powerful up his sleeve to make them all fear him like that. First, we need to know exactly what it is before we go ahead with the uprising. How about weapons? I saw a lot of them in the mill by the river. Should be about five bundles of weapons. If we had those, it would be a huge step for us. So who's your leader, anyway? My brother, Anag. He's holed up in the woods with a few of his people. Somebody needs to go tell him that we need his help here. I have the weapons that you need. You're a good man. We could really use you here. Yeah, level up. What about the runaway slaves? The ones that haven't been torn apart by wild beasts are hiding somewhere to the north. Somebody must take them to our refugee camp in the woods near the pass. A fellow named Freeman will take care of them there. Let's get myself quickly a mana regeneration. Um, where is a Bakaresh? Um, think about it. I think don't think that was really smart. I don't have the teleport to start to sell them yet. I don't have the ingredients for that. We are the chosen people. Wealth for us, dominion for Beliar. And his dominion will come. And then those who have drawn his wrath shall tremble. So pay with your gold, else you shall pay with your blood. Beliar knows no mercy. There is no pity for the weak, only pain and death. Let's hope the mage is here. Teach me something about ancient magic. I want to draw magic power from within myself. Thank you. You couldn't teach me black mage? Teach Okay. Um, to hunting it goes, I suppose. But uh, let's turn for the guild and walk back to Sylvan. that quickly regen but it's regen <laughs> I 
let's instantly get the lizard and the woodcutter. I gave the package to Stan the fisherman. Aha! Uh -huh. Why don't the fishermen come to us anymore? The orcs have doubled their guards. All right. I understand. Thank you. Here, take this gold as a reward. I will now take you to Silden. You weakling. Do you want to enslave me? I'm going to squash you, you bastard. Come here! Hey, uh. folks, there's a fight! Uh. Keep at it. Uh. 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 Cost me 10k, you did. Learning mana regeneration. Excuse me, sir. You're right. Damn, that hurts. You will do what I tell you. I suppose I don't have a choice. Too hard. You will come with me to Silden. Whatever you say. I'll take you out of here. Good. That takes care of that. Nice one. You showed him one filthy beast less. Much for you, filthy beast. Let's go, Meg. I have a new man for you. Admirably done, my friend. Here we shall share the proceeds from the new man. Show me your goods. You will know exactly where our friends come from. Is that supposed to impress me? Alright. 
Alright, so where's the, uh, areas? I found your hammer in the arena. That's good, kid. Now, at last, I can work as a blacksmith again. The city of Silden needs a blacksmith. Ah, very good. Work at last. Then at least I won't be sitting around here feeling completely useless. Hey, come and see me in the smithy sometime if you're interested, kid. I will. Fine. I'll be on my way then. They need guards in the city. Hmm. I'll go have a look then. Go to Denpark and tell him I'll be in town from now on. Yeah, no worry. found everything thanks my friend at last I can start building again here's the reward I promised you don't spend it all in one place maybe you could help me a little more what are you talking about well it's like this I'm not that good at building boats that's why the orcs are still letting me work and am I supposed to explain to you how to build a boat no of course not but if you ever meet anybody I would make it worth your while Bring me something that helps me build better boats. And I swear by my great-grandfather that you will be richly rewarded. Richly? That's good. Any idea where I should start looking? If I knew how and where to look, I would have gone myself. But you won't have much luck in Mitana. The orcs did a thorough job there. Maybe you should try further south. More guards are needed in Silden. Then I'll go over there. Let Denpok know that I'll be in the city from now on. Got it? Got it. Hey, what can I tell you? you this is a story. Stop! Not one step further. That's right. Frillock is now patrolling the city. Well done, Mora. Here's your reward. Brontob will stay in town from now on. Here is your reward. You now have a new blacksmith. His name is Kadok. Finally. Why did that take you so long? Here's your reward, Mora. I don't have a problem with that. Just going to cause it. It's funny that you're right about that. It's a good point, I guess. Sight will never change. And? They arrested you for that? What? Welcome to the Slammer, brother. This camp hardly looks like a jail at all. Don't let the open palisades fool you, brother. The orcs are watching every step of the people here. Why are you here? I tried to steal a fire chalice from the chest of an orc. They caught me, of course. So now they're keeping me locked up here. Why don't you flee? Where would I go? The only chance to avoid the orc patrols lies in the north, but it's way too dangerous in the woods up there because of all the wild beasts. You'd rather be a slave than take a chance? Nonsense. All I'm saying is that fleeing won't get us anywhere. A few have already run for it. They never made it far. You must fight the orcs, brother. Is there anything your boys here need? 
Some slaves have escaped, and the orcs are not amused. So they punish us by starving us. I will fight the orcs. Then listen up now. I know that the orcs are storing weapons in a large cache in the main building. We need at least five bundles of weapons, brother. I will get you something to eat. Great. You should go see Gamble, the cook in town. He keeps the orcs supplied with roast meat. Tell him we're starving. Gamble. That permanently cranky old scumbag? He's your friend? <laughs> yes, he is. He's always a bit funny with strangers. But deep down, he's a kind-hearted soul. I get the picture. I've got weapons for you. Good. Then give us the signal when you want us to strike. Once you engage in battle with the orcs, we will help you. I've got some roast meat for you. Thanks. You saved us from starvation. I've got a few potions here for you, brother. Tell me more about the fire chalice. I don't know a whole lot about it. I'm not a fire mage. The orcs took the chalice away from me and let Zapotec have it for safekeeping. I don't know whether it is still in Zapotec's hut. What do you want? Can't you see that you're bothering me? What sort of a camp is this? Idiot. It's plain to see. This is a prison camp. Moras like you come here when they cause us trouble. How's business? Bad. You Moras just won't listen to reason. You're rebellious. Instead of working for me, you prefer being torn apart by wild beasts. Who's the boss here? I am the boss here. So, you are a master of this city? <sighs> no, of course not. Umbruk is the leader of this sleazy little settlement, and I hope he won't be for very much longer. I suppose you'd like to be in Umbruk's place. Umbruk is soft. The Moras in this city have too much freedom. Umbruk seems to be very popular. Popular? Every orc and every moor in this hole is afraid of him. But I don't believe the stories about his heroic deeds. I would challenge him if I could. What's preventing you from challenging Umbrak? That miserable shaman, Grumple. Umbrak won't do anything without asking his advice. You could almost say that Grumple is the real master of this city. Your slaves are being torn apart by wild beasts? That's right. The idiots run for the mountains, where they get eaten by wolves. Slaves are escaping from your camp? Yes, damn it. I'll have the hide of the fellow who set them free. But most of the slaves are working. Sure. But only because I make them. I could kill Grompel for you. <laughs> I want to see that. Serious about this, aren't you? All right. I will give you a pile of gold if you succeed. I will bring back your slaves. No, you will not kill them. All five of them. That's the only way to make sure the other slaves remain docile. Would the city be greatly weakened if the shaman Grompel died? Let those miserable rebels come. I'm not afraid of them. A human named Enog freed some slaves. I knew it. A dirty mora. I'll think of something special for that guy. Here's your gold for your lousy treason, mora.
I just... Can't. You should go now. Who are you? My name is Lars. I was once a proud warrior from the highlands of Nordmar. But now, I'm rotting here in this prison camp. You fought in the war? Yes. I was the strongest man in my clan back then. Can you make me stronger too? If I finally get to do what I came to the Midlands for, yes, I could. But first, I need to be set free. Why are you in the slammer? I stole from Barak, the arena master. Those boys don't take kindly to stealing, you know. Yes, I know. How can I help you? You can't help me. Unless you have plenty of gold. I'm worth about 300 gold coins. You would have to buy me from Zapotec, the camp commander. I see. How many packages? Seven. I need ten. Eight barrels of fish, eight pets, pelts from the hunters, and where's the other one? Ten. So I still missed three somewhere. Stop! Some valuable things have gone missing here. Do you know anything about that? No. We're watching you. I want to buy the freedom of the Nordmarian, Lars. All right. The Nordman belongs to you. It would be better if he disappeared from here anyway. So far, he's caused nothing but trouble here in camp. Doesn't get much worse. Nothing to do? Usually I hunt up in the mountains instead of hanging around here uselessly. Why are you here in the city? I just delivered some of our pelts to the warehouse keeper. Actually, I wanted to go straight home. But somehow I just can't pull myself together. What do you hunt? Basically everything that lives here on our plains. For that, you sometimes have to be pretty fast and nimble. If you want, I can teach you. But first, you'll have to come with me up to the hunting cabin. Show me your hunting cabin. No problem. Come with me. After you. What are you doing, man?
Here's the hunting cabin. Should I teach you something about hunting here on the plains now? Yes, please. Teach me something about hunting. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's the way. That's the way. 45 left to go, and then uh, I can get Master of Combat. You're creeping around like a thief. Why did you wake me? You're the boss here? Yeah. The orcs rule, friend. My contribution to this community is a rather humble one. Do you work for the orcs? Any human with half a brain does that. Disobeying the orcs would be suicide. That's a sensible standpoint. It certainly is. Even if the orcs set the prices these days. Back then, the humans in Sildan would pay a lot more. How's the hunting here? Very good. Always plenty of prey for a hunter here up north. Snappers, mostly. They fetch a fair amount in Sildan. I can teach you a thing or two about hunting if you like. I want to hunt snappers. Great idea. I think I'll come along. Tell me when you're ready, and off we go. Let's go. Let the hunting begin. Fifty pieces of raw meat. You asked for one filthy beast less. Sorry about the uh, lightning attack, my friend. Beasts are everywhere.
So much for you, filthy beast. Was that all of them? Mm, looks like it. Too bad. Oh well. If you want to know anything else about hunting, just ask me. Too bad indeed. Broken. Quickly deliver the firewood, the barrels of fish, the pelts. And then we're gonna go into the final part of this episode, most likely. Don't mind your own business. Here's your halberd. I found it with the fisherman. Ah. Yes, uh, thank you. The fisherman must have taken it then. You hid the halberd with the fisherman yourself. What? You're a lazy pig, trying to avoid work altogether. If it's a punch in the kisser you want. Well, looks like I'll have to report this then. <clears throat> All right. Tell me what you want. Give me some gold. Mm, here you go. That's all I have. Silden needs more guards within the city. I'll go. But Denpak should know about this. He will, no worries. What is it? Here. I brought some firewood. Fine. Give it here. Here's your reward. Here's the fish. Ah, the barrels of fish. Great. Here's your reward, stranger. Here. I've got pelts from the hunters. Great. Give it here. Here's the gold. Fifteen hundred gold coins. Take the gold to the hunters. But don't dawdle too long or they will get mad. Show me your goods. All right, so um, let me see. There was something I really quickly wanted to do, but I can't remember what. How's it going? Watching the prisoners is truly degrading. I would much rather go back to battle and fight against you, Morris, instead of guarding you. What are the humans doing in the prison camp? The Moras are chopping firewood. From here, it is shipped to all neighboring cities in the Midlands. Would you rather stand guard elsewhere? Of course I would, especially in town. Guarding the city walls is a much more honorable job than this. Ah, yes, I remember. Teleporting to a uh, Belayar shrine. Denpak needs more guards in the city. I'll go. You let Denpak know, understand? He will, no worries. The orcs know that you set the slaves free. Damn it. That makes it even more important that we strike soon. Thanks for the information. Mm. 
We're nearly done, guys, in this part. Stop! Do not say. one step further. Ermac is guarding the city. Well done, Mora. Ganka is staying in town from now on. Good job, kid. Ultimately, they'll make you do it. Alright, so let me quickly teleport to the shrine of Belial. You have to watch what you say. Beliar. Grant me power over death and destruction. So now I can travel with the soul. Anyways guys, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you like what you see, subscribe to my channel hit the like button if you want to see a gothic series hardcore run and i hope to see you guys in the final part of this episode where we're gonna finish uh, the few remaining quests of sylvan so yeah thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys uh, next time